Hi everyone, Jean Oliveira here for oscraps.com and I have the tutorial of the month here for you and today I'm going to use the Whimsical Templates volume number 5 from On a Whimsical Adventure and Remnants of the Past from Lynn Alzek Design and On This Day by Flu uh, Blue Flower Art. So I started here removing uh, you know, taking off the uh, the visibility of the things that I know I'm not gonna use, like in the template here, you can see there's a lot of flowers and things which I don't usually use. So you have to work with templates the way it work for you. If you know you're gonna use all the way that the designer gave you that idea, just go for it. And I I left just some things. Not sure yet if I'm gonna use all those things. But that's how I got it started so far. So I went ahead and she has these two um, textures here. I closed the visibility of one and I got one of the papers from Lynn Alzac on the background. And the texture that is on top, which is kind of some, put to normal here, some kind of leaf pattern. I put to color burn. I changed the color to one of the colors here of his shirt. So I just went with the drop and I click here and I got this color and then I went to edit, fill layer and I filled with the color. So um, she has another paint behind here, the frame. So I just clipped another paper from Lynn Alzac, which is um, some nice uh, watercolor paper here. And she has some really nice papers on this set and did that so i went ahead also and got some of the um elements here that she has she has this nice uh transfers let me see what folder is that she has these nice transfers here as, as you can see the burlap and the gesso so as you can see i just put the burlap here and the gesso here and then I went ahead and got this uh, this one here. This one here actually which is a transfer and I used as a mask for my picture. What I did with my picture here, I clipped that to a mask. As you can see here, she has a transfer with this kind of um, textures. I just clipped the picture to that and I went ahead on the enhance and I went to convert to black and white and I chose a scenic landscape because they are kind of on a landscape there and I hit OK. So now I'm going to continue to layer this and uh, show you when I come back. Okay, so here's the elements that I got. I had to, I decided to pick some other elements from um, just uh, some word arts here. One it's from Picado Designs and another one is from this uh, Designs by Anita. Uh, it was a collab, collab uh, that we have at the store. So I'm gonna put all the links there. Um, but what I came up with was that I just got the clock from uh, Lynn Alzac here. Uh, one of the transfers and the flu, uh, blue flower art I got this tag and I put the tag here and I'm using the um, you know styles from Photoshop elements but I wanted to point out that I go ahead and I change it here because sometimes they are very strong so I don't use as they are so I change them I also got some doodles here from the flu bower, uh, flu um, <laughs> excuse me Lynn Alzic, um kit and uh, I think it's from her. Let's check. Yeah, she has his doodles here. And um, I just put them in overlay mode and another one in overlay mode. And she has some transfer that I script and I put them um, in a blend mode as well. I put them on hard light so and then I make a duplicate ctrl J and I put them one on top here 
So uh, I'm now gonna finish and gonna post the finished layout in the blog post, but pretty much I'm gonna write my journaling and I'm gonna put the date here on this tag. So, um, and then we are all done. So I hope you enjoy. If you have any questions, let us know in the comments from the blog post. Thank you.